Okay, Beast Castle we decided last time. Uh, I have loaded in a randomized ISO now, so this should be a very interesting indeed. And these are all just the shadows that they would usually be, which is a little bit strange and worrying in certain ways. Um, maybe because it's an infinite... No, because we've had other infinite onslaughts of enemies already, right? I did figure out, by the way, that uh, if I were ever to do this in the future, the randomization actually comes with an option of not randomizing uh, the Roxas prologue. Which would make that a lot more doable, because <laughs> I ran into a lot of issues there. Yeah. Oh man, I love, <laughs> I love Magnet Burst this early in the game. Yeah. It's ridiculous. And I love it. So what happens with the statues here? Because usually those would animate in. Do we get a little bit of that animation and then... God recipe. What does that even mean? Is that for a shield? I'm assuming that's for a certain shield for Goofy. I don't know. And we get a couple chests, which... Every chest is actually... It's very fitting that we get a rumbling rose in a chest in Beast Castle, don't you think? And a power boost, which I'm going to equip immediately. I think this leads to the door boss fight. Oh, probably should have safe stated. Oh, it's Axel! Which Axel are you? You are the... Oh, you're Data. No, you're... Oh, you're Data. But we have Mickey! Does that work? That does not work. <laughs> I don't think we can do that. We can immediately get off here and... Okay, that does not work. It's not just the floor, it's the entire arena. So, uh, yeah, you know what I'm going to do? I'm not even going to attempt that. If I run into a data fight this early game, it's just no-go. Because data fights apparently are level 99 by default. It's Leon. Significantly less bad, I think. Oh, that's significantly less bad. That's actually very easy, all of a sudden. Wait, wait why is Anti-Sora there? Is that... Wait, what? Is that the Data Sora from the Vaxxin fight? It must be. But I was sure that looked different from Anti-Sora. Okay, there was a very easy boss fight. I'm very glad we got an easy boss fight for a change. It feels like the game is not happy with me beating that boss fight though, because it's stuck at this screen. I mean, at least we can easily redo the fight if we need to. Antasora still freaks me out a little bit, gonna be honest. Let's just use Valiform, because why... That would be why not. I wonder why the game freaked out there. Is it because there was an Antasora on screen as well? Because in that case, I'm... Very confused as to how Antasora is actually there to begin with. Yeah, I think it's just, uh, it, it's screwed. Let's go to randomization number three. What is it going to be this time? It's almost Amnes. Potentially an issue. That's not that bad, actually. Oh, it's very not that bad. Wow, you're actually very easy to deal with. Wow. Unless you are second armor examiners, but I don't think you are. Yes, you are. Which isn't actually an issue, because I I expected him to... Oh, he's invincible. He's invincible if I don't do the reaction command thing. I think. I can't lock onto him. Oh. Um... For one, there's a deposing shadow. <laughs> That's a new one. And uh, my game froze. No, you're not. But you are a bitch of a boss fight. <laughs> Don't be data. You're not data. Thank God, you're not data. You're still annoying, but you're not data. I'm going to read your comments in a second when Zaxion has killed me. I mean, when I have dealt with the Zaxion. Oh, explosion is so good. Oh, I'm loving explosion. Especially with these short combos. It's absolutely amazing. Donald. Donald. 
Donald, don't be a bitch. No, 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 no. Okay. Can I dispel you? Can I dispel you? Can I dispel you? Please let me dispel you. I want to dispel you. Dispel you, fucker! I just need to finish a combo on you. Will you please let me? Thank you! Wait a second. There's not even walls? In this arena? Around those... Barrier thi Wow! I can just walk through those barriers with the meteor attack. That's good. That's real good for me. Uh, this is uh, amazing for you, maybe. I Well, actually, this is also amazing for me, because it could have been much worse. The first <laughs> randomization I got here was Data Axel, which wasn't fun at all. And Normal Zaxion is actually a pretty nice fight to do. I mean, uh, this is like my fifth try, and I think I'm going to beat him here. Also, this attack becomes significantly less threatening if you can walk through the barriers. It, it is over. You're right, Sora, because explosion that guy to fucking oblivion. ID not found. <laughs> I still have that. I still don't know if I can do anything with it. I don't think I can. Adobe really wants me to have a powerful CPU. Wait, a poster? What even is that item for? It's definitely something in Twilight. Proof of non-existence. Do I get a crown? I have a crown! Nice! I don't know what the poster is. I'm assuming that has something to do with one of the part-time jobs in Twilight Town, which I just never did. It's Vaxxin. It's normal Vaxxin. Look, lucky me, it's normal Vaxxin. Okay. Normal Vaxxin shouldn't be that big a deal. Can normal vaccine even make data sauras? Because if normal vaccine can't make data sauras, the difficult part of this fight isn't even a thing. Other than the fact that vaccine still is a bit annoying to deal with. Well, actually, not that bad. No, vaccine is not an issue whatsoever because there's no data sora. Yeah, no, this is definitely a lot easier than the original vaccine fight. Significantly so. Wait a second, can we already do the absent silhouette for Malusha after this? Because it's in this room. Or do we only get that on the second visit here? But that's Vaxxin done. So now we get Party and we also have Summon now. So we can Summon Chicken Little on Peter Pan already. Which we're never going to do. Peter Pan is actually a pretty good Summon though. Don't get me wrong. So yeah, the Absent Silhouette isn't here yet. It's only up on the second visit. Bond of Flame. Peter Pan is a pretty OP Summon. Uh, it's probably the best Summon in the game. It's a summon I use when uh, leveling up my summon level for 100% uh, in the game. I only use Peter Pan. A what? A what? <laughs> a what? Um. <laughs> There goes the castle. And the skybox. There's only half a skybox here, that's interesting. Yeah, definitely gonna have to reload here, but I don't know what my last save point is. Well, AMD definitely... I don't think it's a question. Um, wins a lot of things, especially... No! No! No, 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 no. Fuck you! Oh, that's a... Possibly just as bad. Are you data? Don't be data. You don't have your water forms around you. Um. I didn't consider this. I did not consider this. Out of all the data fights, by the way, Xamnas is not the worst by far. Uh, it's probably one of the easier. I wouldn't want to face data Xamnas. Don't get me wrong. If Data Zemna shows up, I will cry. But, uh, yeah, Damix isn't making things uh, any better. Oh, you could be a thing. Luxord, I hate Luxord. <laughs> oh, this is, this is so easy. Wait a second, is this going to be both stages of his boss fight? Because he has two stages to his boss fight as well. Uh, normal looks at it isn't that bad. Data looks at it is actually... 
one of the most da uh, difficult data fights because at some point uh, to finish him off you have to do something that's near frame perfect normal looks at this annoying but once you get a feel for him it's a loroxine is it data loroxine no it's normal loroxine which is still bad don't get me wrong loroxine is a real annoying fight especially if you don't have reflect Okay, doing well so far, to be honest. I expected Lorik seemed to be much more of an issue. Then again, I am a little bit overleveled. And I'm also kind of thankful for the fact that I now have a healer on my team, which makes things significantly more doable than when I was Roxas. You see, when you're Sora, the game becomes a lot easier than when you're Roxas. Especially when, uh, when you're randomizing things. <laughs> That's a real important part of that sentence. Okay, maybe if you're not being stupid like I am, this could potentially be somewhat easy. Okay, I'm going to lose this one. I still had a drop. Okay. Um, now it's all over because this probably will crash the game. So I'm going to go with Goofy rather than Beast because of uh, Velaform. Because Velaform is a fancy way to heal. Maybe a couple of potions wouldn't be a bad idea either for this fight. I'll see if I need them. How about that? If I die now, I'll uh, not use the save state and I'll go get potions. Oh, if I just stand here, she literally can't do anything to me. Okay, I think I've got a strategy for dealing with uh, desperation move as well. Oh, you teleport so much, Lurxine. I mean, I know you're apparently an important character now because Nomura makes everybody important. I don't know why, because he can't come up with new fucking characters. Um, apparently, you're now a Keyblade person from... The Ferris Hill time. Okay, so this is your wannabe... Oh, so that is still a bit of an issue. <laughs> Not as much as I assumed it would be. But let's go Valorform. Why do you T-pose me? Why does that T-pose? There's nothing weird about using Valorform against Laroxene. As a matter of fact, I would say that's probably a decent idea. Does it T-pose me because it doesn't know if I'm supposed to be an Antiform? Is that it? Do I have to hit them both for the merge? I still don't know how the merge mechanic works. I've battled Loroxene countless times in this game. Still have no idea how the reaction command for her works. It just seems random. Which is never a good thing. Especially not when you're facing her when you're definitely not supposed to face her. I know how I did so much damage to her before. I managed to explode both of her clones. So maybe I don't want to merge her. No, that's stupid, because she's dealing way more damage to me than I am to her. I don't know if that's true, actually. Now that I see how much damage I'm doing, it might be beneficial for me after all. I'm getting real close to being killed as well, though, so that's uh, potentially a bit of an issue. But I still have dry forms, which T-pose me for reasons hitherto unknown. No, don't do that again. That's an annoying move to deal with, because I don't have glide. Just, just fucking let me kill you. Okay, I'm gonna die, and I'm gonna, bo I'm gonna buy potions. Uh, guys, what happened with your fucking potions? Also, I have potions of my own. I'm, I'm aware. It's a little bit my own fault. <laughs> okay, I've definitely got this. Um, also, yeah, I was gonna say you haven't really done uh, much in the move of desperation moves yet, which is uh, a little bit scary and also comforting at the same time. Okay. Just one more co- Damn it! Peter Pan, you are actually a very smart individual. Um, how about... Thank you. Never mind. For some reason, that, uh... That doesn't do what you think you will, what you think it'll do. This is also kind of disturbing. Also, uh, this attempt is going even better than the last one. So, in a way, you did me a favor. No, 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 no. Good. Oh, look at that. I got Retaliating Slash. That's the third one. Ooh, Loroxene, you uh, didn't age that well, did you? Okay, next time, Land of Dragons. That'll be a fun time.